doctor's appointment 15 month checkup he's gonna get shots i hate when my baby gets shots i do not like it i know he hates it but i, I wish somebody can come to these appointments for me because i don't like watching them stick my baby helping them hold him down to stick him uh it's the worst it's the worst um but he we just left school and i woke him up from his nap he was sleeping he's still tired with butt he's still tired like a shady baby he give you all the faces i can't wait till you find some words because he's giving all the faces like girl who you talking to Well, um, I'm going to go ahead and get parked, and we will see you guys inside of his appointment. Okay, so it's about 2.15, and his appointment is at 2.30. I really want some Starbucks, but I think I'll just go ahead and head in here for his appointment. And uh, I really want Starbucks, but I'll wait. I don't think this appointment will take that long. It can be in and out. And let's get in here. Let's just get in. Uh -oh. I would. Uh -oh. <laughs> I would like to get to know if I could be the kind of girl that you could be down for. Cause when I look at you, I feel something tell me that you're the kind of guy that I should make a move on. I could be wrong, but I feel. Where is it? Oh. My baby's growing good. 23 pounds. And 30 inches long? 31 inches long. His dad is pretty short and I'm pretty tall. So I'm really curious as to how tall he'll get. That's the mama big boy. That's a big boy. Can you say hi, Harlem? He's gulping down this water. You're so thirsty. So, oh. Um, he has to do two shots today. And I've been so anxious about these shots. Again, I don't like helping them do them, but I be trying to figure out which ones are like necessary, which ones aren't. Are you a mom that does it? I know shots are, maybe no shots are required, but I really want to make sure he's just healthy at the end of the day. So we do some shots. We have never done the flu shot. But my baby's growing good. He ain't, he ain't missing no meals. He don't really get sick. But, um, no complaints, huh? He's just like, good eater. He eats. Eats and eats and eats. And after the doctor's appointment, I think we're going to go to Ikea with a friend. Maybe grab some dinner. I really need a drink or a snack or something. I'm starving. Somebody stopped and get that before. But, we made it to his appointment. Got here a little early, so we're gonna get out a little earlier. Perfect. I don't have to go back to work. So this works out, right? Right? Okay, guys. What else? Are you getting big? Are you getting bigger and bigger? Mm-hmm. He's a little bit 
23 pounds. Wait a while. And 31 inches. Yes! Yes, I think it's right. Twinkle, 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 little star, how I wonder what you are. Up above the stars. Oh, and this you know your name. <laughs> you know your name. You want to get dressed? Not yet. Oh, I'm on. Oh, here's some. Here's some. Girl, walk it off. Got them two shots in that leg. Come on. This way. First floor. Whoa. So we out of that appointment. We got out of the appointment pretty decent time. I don't even know what time it is. 312. Only an hour appointment. Can't beat that at all. Walk across the street. Get me some Starbucks. And head to the next destination. See you at the next destination. Oh, so sad. That Starbucks is not open to the public, so. Figure out another way. Another option. Starbucks one way or the other. I'm about to get me some because I'm cleaning and I'm hungry. I just want a cheese Danish or something. I'm going to figure it out. Do. Harlem's like, hey. There's a doggy. You see him? Daddy, come here. So, where you go? Come here, Ted. Where you go? Oh, there he goes. Maybe I'll get behind him. Come here, Bubba's. Oh, he, he ran up the stairs. Come here. Come here. Say, come, come, doggy. Come, come, Harlem, can you say, come, come, doggy? Say, come, come, doggy. Here he comes. You want to doggy? Yeah, come, come, doggy. Look at him. Come, come, doggy. Hi. Say hi, baby. It's a baby, Harlem. It's a baby. Say hi, baby. It's okay. No, no, no. It's okay. He wants to carry away. It's okay, Wilbur. Is that funny? Is that funny, Mom? Is that funny? You can go pet the doggy, you never don't want to scare him. <gasps> oh, the chair is so cute. Harlem, you need a chair? I'm going to get you mid air. With a stroller. Oh, that's what he's singing. He's probably shocked that you know it. <laughs> he always gets shocked like, other people know that song. Oh my goodness. Uh, the high one? The high back? High, uh, the high, high back. So, 
I'm looking for a clearance. What's that? Oh. Wait, but this is the last one, or is it in a box somewhere? I think it's just continuous, so I don't the last one. Oh. But all the last, like, other stuff, is not that stuff. Let's go look. Mm. What are you doing? You found them. Oh, grab on. So we just detangled her hair, and I'm so proud of her. She didn't cry. What? She didn't cry not even a little bit. And she used to boo a who every time she got her hair cut. Cause I don't cry because um when I was my daddy's house, um my auntie, her mom, she brushes my hair really hard cause she's heavy handed, and I don't cry. You don't. <laughs> He's your daddy. What? Did you grow out of crying? I guess so. Oh, wow. So what are you about to put your hair? Uh, we're about to put four braids in my hair. Four of them? You want four braids? Yeah. Okay. That's what my mom said. Gotta figure out how to do these braids. Her mama showed me a hairstyle, and I gotta remember what it looked like. And I don't feel like texting or doing nothing to figure out. So I'm gonna just, I'm gonna just one, two, three, four it real quick. So, uh. I'll text her. Let's get to it. And I'm being lazy. I, I'm so tired. It's, what, 10 o'clock at night? I have no clue. Yes, it's 10 o'clock at night. And I don't feel like doing this. But we just gonna get it done real quick. One for the master, one for the master. 
Hey guys, so we're back, and I definitely fell asleep putting Harlem to bed. Zari came back and woke me up to finish her hair, so here we are to finish her hair, and I do not feel good, but we're gonna finish it up. What made you sick? I don't know. I think I, I don't know if I ate too much or. I mean, I, I felt like, like that a couple days, but. You eat too much? No, when, um, cause I was at home and I had the plan that's the fan blasting and I got sick and mm -hmm. my stomach started hurting. Mm -hmm. But I felt like I had to throw up. Yeah, I feel like I got to throw up too. I feel like I've been not resting enough this weekend. I'm so exhausted. Mm -hmm. I almost fell asleep putting her on sleep. Well, I guess I did fall asleep because you woke me up. Yeah, um, and then she was taking too long, so I was like, I don't know. Yeah, and then she was taking too long, so I was like, she must have fell asleep while Harlem, with Harlem. And the next thing you know, I see you sleep with Harlem.
Okay. That's it, you guys. I'm about to put a scarf on and go to bed because I'm tired. Turn on so see the whole thing. Turn. Turn. I'm already sleeping. Bye.